Two shootings at the same Kenosha bar in less than a month. One of them took the lives of two people. That bar is now shut down and likely will not reopen. Fox 6's Bill Misson explains it's not because of the city. At Las Margaritas a Memorial on the door, flowers and candles on the front step. Las Margaritas has been closed since the shooting more than a week ago and likely won't open again after the owner surrendered its licenses last week. Multiple people run out and they're sitting inside of the tavern. The tavern, Las Margaritas, it was back on September 18th. Four people were shot. Have the wounded walk down to the rescue? Yeah, rescue squad's gonna have to come here. They're not uh, mobile. Two people were killed. One of them was Houston Oliver. The other, a friend of Michael Ross. I broke down crying right in the parking lot. You know what I mean? It's like I was just with him. You know what I mean? So it hurts. Ross lives near the bar. We talked to him in the hours after the shooting. They try to produce a, a happy place where everybody can come have a good time. It's the people. It's not the first time the bar has seen trouble. Kenosha police were called to it in late August. Three people were shot during a fight. But it seems the doors will no longer open to the public. On Friday, the owner of Las Margaritas, Sylvia Benitez, voluntarily surrendered her licenses to the city. We tried getting a hold of her by phone. Hi, Ms. Benitez. But uh, this is no Jane answer. Liston with Fox 6 News. We also reached out to her attorney, but didn't hear back. I decided to surrender my licenses. But Benitez did call me back. I didn't sign up for the violence that has been associated with my establishment. She says the surrendering of her licenses was her decision and not prompted by talks with the city. It was a personal choice that I made. We reached out to Kenosha police for an update in the case, but didn't hear back. We'll be sure to tell you when we do. Reporting in Kenosha, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News. Bill, thank you.